This morning, more students are saying goodbye to summer vacation and waking up early for class. Yes, today is the first day of school for Humble ISD. KPRC 2's Brittany Jeffers joining us live from Humble Middle School with how the district has prepared for the first day. Brittany, good morning. Yeah, good morning to you. Well, as you mentioned, we're saying goodbye to summer break. More than 48,000 here uh, students that are enrolled in Humble ISD will be heading back to the classroom today. And there's lots of new updates within the district that we want to tell you about, including some new classes. But first of all, there's also a new campus that will be opening today, and that is a middle school, Autumn Ridge Middle School, uh, that's located on Woodland Hills Drive, will open its doors for the very first time today. Another new facility North Agricultural Science Center will replace the existing Kingwood Ag Barn. That barn had flooded several times and this new facility is located on Mills Branch Drive near Kingwood and Kingwood Park High Schools. There's also some renovations underway at Charles Street Stadium and some new classes available for students. Humble ISD high school students will uh, in grades 10 through 12 will have the option of enrolling in barbering courses as an elective and there's also a new drone piloting program being launched at multiple secondary campuses to help prepare students to obtain their license. Now, as students at those 46 campuses prepare to head back, the Summer Creek principal certainly pumped up about it. There was some video posted to Twitter of him kicking off the beginning of the year with some of the student athletes here, uh, Principal Brent McDonald. So everybody excited to begin this school year. And of course, as we know, safety is always at the forefront of parents' minds as kids enter back into the classrooms. Now we did find out yesterday uh, precinct four announced that it will be partnering up with six uh, police departments uh, within six school districts, including Humble ISD. And so coming up in the next hour, I'm going to have a lot more on that and how there will be an increased police presence within those school districts. Reporting live this morning from Humble, I'm Brittany Jeffers, KPRC 2 News. All right, Brittany, exciting day out there. Thank you.